Hello guys, welcome back to this channel. If this is your first time visiting this channel, don't forget to subscribe, like and share, and also hit the notification bell for all the upcoming videos. Today we're gonna talk about how to practice uh, your scales on the piano. And we have many, many scales that uh, you can practice. We have uh, the major scales, we have uh, the minor scales, we have the blues scales, we have the uh, pentatonic scale. So there are a lot of different type of scales that you can learn and you can practice. But I'm gonna show you the way that, that is the, the easiest way to practice your scales and also to memorize all the notes on that scale. So we have 12 keys on the piano, which means we're gonna have 12 keys, 12 keys to learn all the scales in. Uh, I'm going to start in the key of C and all the way to B so we can uh, learn those uh, major scales. So the C major scale, uh, before I play the scale, me, I usually play the chord so we can, uh, let's say the C major chord and then we go to the C major scale. So this is the C major scale. In my left hand, I'm just playing the C major triad, which is a C, E, G. We're gonna move up to the key of D which is a D major triad and the D major scale. We're gonna move up to E major. This is the E major scale. F major scale. G major scale. A major scale. And the B major scale. And we have a D flat major scale. E flat major scale. F sharp major scale. A flat major scale. and B flat major scale. So 
So this is the 12 major scale on the piano. It's not easy to memorize, but the best way you can practice your scale is always play the chord, play the major triad chord on your left hand, and then play the scale with the right hand. So for example, like C, like we just did, the C major. So you just play the C major triad with your left hand, and you play the C major scale with your right hand. And I think this is one of the best way to practice your scales. Just so, let's say, uh, if ever you want to improvise on that key, so you know exactly how the notes sounds like, and also you can uh, get familiarized with all the notes by just playing the chord and playing the scale with the right hand. I think uh, if you want to practice your scales, just make sure you practice all 12 of them and try to memorize them. It's not easy, but uh, just uh, start very slow and learn them one by one. And eventually you will memorize them. And also we have uh, different uh, fingering techniques for each scale. So for example, let's say if you're playing the C major scale, you do one, two, three, and you cross under with your thumb. So one, two, three, and you cross under. But if you're playing the F major scale, it's different. So you play one, two, three, four, and you cross under. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So some of some of the scales, uh, when when you're playing them, the correct fingering is uh, the fingerings are different. So C major, you cross under after the first the first three notes. Uh, compared to F, you just uh, cross under after the first four notes. So learn all your major major scales, and also learn all the uh, the fingering techniques, which finger you use for each scale. And don't forget, you practice with the chord, with the major triad chord. If you if you practice if you practicing your minor scales, you could play the minor the minor chord on your left hand, and then you play the minor scale with the right hand. And if you're practicing your major scales, you play the uh, major chord on your left hand and you play the uh, major scale on your right hand. So I hope you guys uh, like this video and don't forget to leave your comments below if you have any questions. And if you haven't done so, just don't forget to subscribe to this channel, uh, like and share, and also hit the notification button for all the upcoming videos. See you guys in the next video.